In this video, I'm going to show you how to prepay for inventory. So let's say you don't have a purchase order created, you don't have anything set up in your system, but you did just pay for an order with your credit card or your bank account, and you wanna mark that and use that amount to pay a future bill. So what you're gonna do is go to vendors inside of your accounting app. We're gonna to go to payments, and we're just gonna create a new payment. We're sending money to one of our vendors. So we'll just say vendor one. And the amount of this was, let's say $150. I'm gonna say prepayment for new inventory. And we can just confirm that. That's all we need to do. Now we've paid $150. So now that we made that payment, we can now reconcile that payment and create the rest of our items at a later date or all of our items at a later date. So let's say we're buying some new inventory. We don't have it in the system yet, but we know we want to buy it. So we paid the vendor for $150. Now our bank statement comes in. We're just going to create a manual bank statement here and payment for goods. So now our whole process of reconciling will you know, be straightforward. We'll pay for that. Everything's good in our books. Next week, our products come in and we realize we have to register the payment, or I'm sorry, we have to receive the products. So we'll create that vendor bill at the time now or the purchase order at this time. And that was for vendor one. I'm just gonna create a new product. Let's call it new product. And we'll say that was $150. We'll confirm this order. We can receive the products. And now we wanna create that bill inside of our system. So we're gonna create the bill. Select that and we see it's for vendor one here. So now once we confirm this bill, we're gonna see our payment at the bottom here. We have outstanding debits for vendor one. And if we went and wanted to add, say that we were gonna pay for this vendor bill with the debit that we already have. So we can click add. And now this is marked as paid because we prepaid for the inventory and we're just applying that credit um, or debit in this case to our bill in order to balance out our books.